let's come back uh, to the reasons uh, which bring you to Prague. Uh, it is a project uh, that reflects and questions uh, the period of uncertainty uh, we are going through. Um, it is a project also that relates uh, to the male art movement. Uh, I will let you uh, pronounce the title and I'd like you to tell us more about these uh, ideas behind the work. So the title is Translations of All Our Lost Passions and Future Desires. Um, beyond the idea of the, the situation now, uh, the project is, is also made for the Kunstalle and the situation of the Kunstalle right now. Like the, the, the museum is still under construction for me. So uh, you said in the beginning there was actually a past, an history about the building and in one year it will be different. So it's um, I'm playing with the, the idea of the, the temporality and, and of course you know the architecture and, and, and many things. So let's go, let's go on the project. The first action actually is the, is the, is the facade project, it's the text project that I put on the facade and I think I think this uh, this part is is related to the first chapter of the title uh, called translation uh, translation of different languages of course uh, we are talking in English uh, all the communication is made in English and in Czech but the piece is written in Malagasy so it's um, I think we are going back on this again on this idea of like uh, we are not made only with one language, uh, one language, we are not only made with one attitude, we are made with a different aspects and, and different dreams. Uh, so then the second chapter is the lost passions. Uh, lost passions, it's actually, it sounds a little bit dramatic, but it's, uh, but it's a kind of, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm just trying to, to, to confirm that we are really in, in a kind of unknown time. We don't know what will happen tomorrow. But the third chapter is actually the future desire because we still have some desires. And I think the Kunstalle is also an amazing desire, uh, not only for art. I think it's for art, it's for, it's for, it's for, it's for Prague, it's also for, for, for the world, I hope. But um, yeah, but it's, it's, it, how can I say that? It's, it's, an, it's a moment that I just want to say that, okay, here we are and I'm always working actually with the context. There was something yesterday, but the most interesting thing is like tomorrow. So I start actually from outside the facade, uh, a discussion with the city, uh, a discussion also with the world, because we are actually, you are using a lot of things from social media and it's a, it's a, it's a text piece. So it's a real discussion between like uh, the facade and outside. The second part of the project is inside. Inside, in this space, which is like, uh, it's still not a real, it's not finished yet. So I decided actually uh, for the next, during the next following months to create a piece, 10 pieces exactly, uh, made with different materials. Some of them I know, some of them I don't know because it depends on my mood, depends on the mood of the world also. Yes, it's actually a, a story in uh, several acts you are telling us through these works. And uh, the letter objects, let's call them like that, uh, we have actually received already one piece mm -hmm. while you are here in Prague, so that you could also install it. Uh, the, the other ones, uh, you won't be on site, but we will communicate with you uh, to find the best uh, setting for those pieces. And the first letter object, that yeah, uh, you, you send us is a monochromatic black uh, huge collage. Mm -hmm. uh, why did you decide to send us this very uh, object for the f introduction, let's say, of the series? Uh, yes, the the first one was uh, the, uh, the first one is the neon piece. The second one is this uh, this piece. The title of this piece is the playground of the present. So, uh, like an architect, you know, I'm I'm taking the space. So it's just. Uh, I'm, I'm giving actually a frame, a framework where we can play, where we can dance, where we can actually dream about something. So I, I, th that's maybe con conceptually it's coming from there. Then for the, for the, for the medium, I, I actually I use the same paper that I'm using most of the time, like in Venice, for example, and I did many collages everywhere. I think we also met actually through, you know, this, this paper, this paper work. So I just decided to, 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 to place it again um, 
here uh, as an announcement, as a, a non-geographical piece. It's just like it's something, it's a, it's a gesture um, where, we can, when we, where we can imagine something. I can talk a lot about the piece because it's, uh, again, we are talking about this uncertainty. Uh, so what is the present? So this is, the following pieces will be may, maybe more clear because then I'm using more text and, and I will use actually different languages like English, French, Czech and everything. Maybe the black monochromatic is to also, it's, a, it's an answer or, or it's, um, it's a mark. Uh, I just want to say like, okay, I'm here. You know, we were talking about this idea of, of black and most of the people are talking about the black. So maybe it's, um, yeah, it's a sign that I'm here. <laughs>